Don't worry, I'm not giving spoilers about anything. <laughs> I have told not one person the ending of Game of Thrones. I would ban anyone being killed for, you know, punishment. I'm, I'm a, you know, I'm here for democracy. So let's like do that instead of just killing people for no reason. For me, there's only one answer, and that is Conniff Hill, who is hilarious, and we have such a giggle. I would just fly to warm places, just like on the weekend, because I feel, you know, I live in London, so it's often kind of chilly here. Samuel Tali, because I think Masande and Sam would be friends, because they're book smart, and they're like cool nerds, you know? They'd have a lot to talk about. I would probably choose Arya, because she's a badass. Cersei, to be honest. Because she didn't believe that they existed until we had to show her. So that would be kind of good karma. <laughs> I genuinely was like heartbroken when Hodor died. I don't, I don't think I'm quite over that even now. The happy ending that I would write for Masande and Grey Worm would probably be that they went back to the Summer Isles or to Nar and lived happily ever after, like sunning themselves on a beach somewhere. <laughs> I think Cersei actually takes it for me. She kind of slays in the wardrobe department. So Davos, um, sorry Liam, but um, that costume I don't think it's changed in like five seasons or something. Probably people asking you what happens. That is annoying, to be honest. I know everyone like loves it and I'm so like grateful for their appreciation of the show, but like seriously, just stop asking what happens because I'm not gonna tell you. I am a fortress. When Jon Snow was dead, ah, oh, that was the worst time ever. Daenerys on the throne. Shake things up a bit. Somebody who like cares about people. That would be good. masande has been by her side, you know, in these pivotal moments. And so it'd be kind of cool to see her get there finally. <sighs> what will I miss most about Game of Thrones? My cast, like, and the crew and just everyone that worked on it. It's like really weird that it's over and that we're not going to go back next year to start shooting the next season. I'm not going to cry. No, I'm joking. <laughs>